Hello everybody, welcome to this tutorial on how to do green screen face cams in iMovie. Okay guys, so this was something I had to figure out uh, about a week ago. About a week ago, we could... Because I just got my green screen. Um, I know you can't see it at the moment, but we'll, you'll be able to see it in a minute. Um, and because of that, I of course wanted to use it for my face cam. Um, I figured out a way to do it and I thought I'd share it with you guys because I couldn't really find any good tutorials out there. Um, I found a couple which helped us understand a bit but didn't help too much. So I'm going to try to make it as simple as possible for you to understand today. Um, so first what you're going to do, um, I'm going to assume by the way guys that you've watched my previous tutorial on how to record a regular face cam in iMovie. Uh, this is going to be kind of a little extension to that. Um, and because of that I'm not actually going to be recording gameplay this uh in this video because you would have learned how to do that last video um and i'm also going to assume if you haven't seen that video you've already seen some sort of other tutorial and you know how to record gameplay anyway um so yeah going on that i'm just going to teach you how to do the actual green screen video itself so what we're going to do you're going to go to iMovie and just like you would normally uh, record green screen you're going to click import sorry record a face cam anyway and then it'll bring up your face cam uh, if it's not on if it's like let's say on some sort of file organizer just click face cam uh, facetime sorry um well yeah facetime camera but you know it's just a just just a camera okay so now you're in this the color's a bit uh, funny for some reason i don't know why but um you're just gonna start recording your gameplay start recording your face cam like you would normally do like i showed you in the last tutorial that i've done not very last but you know what i mean the last uh, face cam on and then what you'll do, you'll just go here, you'll open up a game, and you'll have that recording. I would usually have this on my other monitor, so I can keep an eye on it. Um, but just because I'm going to assume not all of you have two monitors, on three or whatever, I'm just going to imagine it's like this. If you open up a game and start playing it, it'll still record. It just means if it does stop recording, you won't be able to see, but it's still not bad. Now, you've got a recording, let's say you finish recording your game. You're about to finish, well, you finished that episode of the gameplay or whatever it was. Um, and now you want to finish your face cam. You're just going to click stop like usual. It's all the same up to this point. And there you go. There's your face cam recorded for your gameplay. You've got your face cam here. You will have your gameplay once you've exported it and all that. Um, and that's pretty much all that. By the way, I made a little uh, thing here, a little... What are these called? Category things, uh, just to hold the stuff for this tutorial, just so you know. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to quickly click new movie. I'm going to call this green screen tutorial as well. Just we'll have a little place to actually make the video. Green screen tutorial. There we go. Nice. So it's nice, a little organized thing. We've got the video here ready to edit. We've got the face cam. Now we need some gameplay, which you would have recorded at the same time. But for the purposes of this video, I'm just going to grab a random bit of gameplay that I've already recorded in the past for a different video. Um, so I'm going to drag this in here. Right, let's, we don't need it all, so I'm just going to drag a little bit out of it. Because, of course, the face cam isn't actually as long as the video. Um, now, when you're actually doing this, you will align them up properly and stuff. Because you will need it aligned properly. But I'm just doing a basic overview, like I've already said. Just to make it a lot quicker, a lot simpler for you to understand. Um, so, yeah. Now, what you're going to have is you're going to have this gameplay... Uh, at the bottom here and you're gonna have your face cam at the top here But first thing we're gonna need to do we're gonna need to crop it down correctly because if you look on the actual preview You can see some stuff that you don't want to see and um, Depending on how you have your green screen set up. It might be okay. It might not be okay uh, If your green screen covers the entire background, then that's fine. You could leave it alone um, But I would want to crop it anyway just so it's a bit better in relation to my head So there's not so much excess stuff showing so I'm just gonna click this in the corner Go here, by the way, to crop, crop to fill, make it a bit smaller, there we go, now it's on my head, make it a bit bigger, actually. So there we go, it's not bad now. Now we've got that, let's just play the video. Face cam, which, like you would normally do, like I showed you in the last tutorial that I've done, not very last, but you know what I mean, the last, yeah. So yeah, as you can see, uh, the size of it's pretty okay. Now what we're going to do, we're going to click on this, which is the, like, just general option area kind of thing. You're going to click here, and you're going to click green slash blue screen. This is going to automatically detect the green screen, and it uh, should make it quite a bit better. There we go. Okay, now you may notice some blur in the background. To get rid of this, you're going to click up here. Uh, you could either use both of the cleanup tools. This one will crop it, so it's automatically going to delete everything outside of that box. Uh, but just in case I move around a bit and I still want to see myself on screen, I'm just going to use this one, which will detect the blur when you click on it. And delete all the blur so now it's nice 
Oh, I just killed my face. Holy crap. I'm going to just undo that. Uh, use Command-Z to do that. That little blur, uh, blur there doesn't look like I can actually get rid of that. So I'm just going to... Could I do that, maybe? Yeah, you know what? That'll do. That'll do. Just get rid of that. Never had to do that before, but... Keeps it nice and clean. Now we don't have any excess stuff. Right. You may notice the face cam is not in the bottom corner, though. Or top corner, wherever you want to position it. That's where things change with this. Because if you go to picture in picture, it's going to take away the green screen. You can put it in the bottom. And then you may be like, well, why don't I just turn the green slash blue screen back on now? <clears throat> when you do that, it's going to re -full size it. And it's going to go back to this. So this is where things will have to change. Everything I've just showed you for this part, you're going to have to completely forget about. Because this does not actually happen. I've just been showing you what a lot of people will try to do. But then they can't do it. So, what you're going to do, instead of getting your gameplay and putting it over, you're going to go into Google and find a nice green background. Um, I've just typed in here, chroma key green 1920 by 1080 p uh, There's a good one. That's got a little watermark, so I'm not actually going to get that one. I'll get this one. Doesn't really matter the scale of it, um, as long as it's got a 16 by 9 aspect ratio. Oh, hello. Didn't want to go there. Um, it's just so you can have something to put in the background. You'll understand it all in a minute. But let's just continue. You're going to right click, save image as. <coughs> Sorry about that. And then you're just going to save it as whatever you want. So I'm going to just call this green background. Save. Then you're going to go back uh, to your... La, 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 la. Your iMovie. I can't talk today. Don't know if you noticed. I can never talk. What am I on about? Then you're going to go to the side or your downloads, whatever it is. You're going to click on your downloads grab the green background and you're just going to drag it in so now I've got this like nice little green background and if you're kind of following along you might understand what I'm going to do and um, this took us a while to figure out but it's actually quite simple so what you're going to do you're going to get your green background you're going to put your um, face cam over it and you're going to just extend the green background all the way across the face cam uh, doesn't have to be perfect as long as it covers so now you've got this like weird thing with that green background there and you've got your face cam here you're now going to picture and picture your face cam into the bottom corner you're going to crop it like you've done before like so and then you'll have this kind of face cam looking thing um which it'll make sense in a minute um in the bottom so you'll have that face cam in the bottom there uh i don't know why it's not showing it when i'm not actually playing it but there it is there now what you're going to do with this, you're going to export it. So you're going to click share as a file. Um, I want to just make sure that's actually showing because for some reason it's not letting us see the green screen. The face cam, sorry. There we go, okay. Share, file, green screen tutorial. That's what I'm going to call it. You can call it whatever you want. Keep it the highest resolution you can. Unfortunately, I can't have 1920 by 1080 probably because of the background image that I got, but it still works. So I'm just going to save it to wherever you want. I'm going to save it to my desktop for now. And once it's finished exporting, it should take about 30 seconds or so. You can delete this here and then get on with the actual video, which you can edit. So this is almost, this is starting now. And um, as you can see, it will appear... On the desktop here this is it editing this is it exporting sorry and um, once it's done you're going to bring it back into here you're going to get your gameplay overlay it and do a green slash blue screen again so it is in the bottom corner but you can still keep that green screen effect and um, it will need a bit of cleaning up because these shades of green are two different types of green but it still works it's a bit complicated but uh, after a few tries you'll get the hang of it and um, so there we go, it's now exported. I'm just going to click this and I'm going to take it to iMovie over here. I'm going to delete this and there we go. We've got a new. Oh, shite. Just accidentally deleted there. Uh, delete that. Then we've got a new face cam video down here, which has still got all the audio. It's got um, everything we need. It's fine, it works. So now we're going to, let's say, get the gameplay that we had actually ready recorded. So let's say, I think it's about 50 uh, minutes. La, 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 la. I think this is about a minute long, so I'll just get that, put it over. Okay, maybe not, but I'll crop this down. And now we have got our face cam in the corner above our gameplay. Um, so what we'll do, we'll turn the green screen on. There we go. It starts. 
to look good. We've got a green screen in the bottom corner, a uh, face cam, sorry. We've got a gameplay in the background. Um, because there's two different types of green, it detected the most dominant one first, so this that's why this is still blurry. So if you just click here again, use the cleanup tool, click that weird coloured thing, it'll start to get rid of it. Click it again, just keep clicking until it gets rid of all the colour. Sometimes it can be a bit, bit of a hassle. Just need to kind of keep going. Oh my god, it's never been like this before. <laughs> oh well. Oh, there's my face gone. But you, you get the idea. You just go do this until it's nice and clean. Um, might be because of my lighting at the moment that's messing up. Uh, but for you it could be easier. So, yeah, you just kind of want to get it until it's right for you. Um, I'm just going to say that's it for now. So as you can see, we've got the face cam in the corner. I would usually do a lot more cleaning up to make sure it's perfect. Um, at the moment I'm not going to do that just because I want to keep this video as short for you, as short as possible anyway. Then what you can do, you can click share, file, I'm going to call this green screen tutorial as well, next, save, replace, because you don't need the face cam anymore now that it's here. <coughs> and then once it's exported, it'll be here and that video is ready to show. I will play that video for you once it's exported and then that'll be the end of this video. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please like, favorite and subscribe if it helped. I know I'm not very good at tutorials, but I'm trying my best. So I'd really appreciate some support. But yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. Please like, favorite and subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you in the next episode of whatever I make. Bye! Okay guys, I forgot to mention, um, if tapping it doesn't work to clean it up, um, instead of tapping it like this, because that can also fail a bit, you can actually hold it down if you want and just drag it over it. Then it'll make it a bit nicer and clean it up. So just thought I'd mention that to you guys, because it might be kind of important. But yeah, that's it. See you later. Face cam was like you would normally do, like I showed you in the last tutorial that I've done. Not very last, but you know what I mean, the last uh, face cam one. And then what you'll do, you'll just go here, you'll open up a game, and you'll have that recording. I would usually have this on my other monitor, so I can keep an eye on it. Um, well done. Just Here come the test not results. Have cute monitors you are a horrible person. I'm just gonna That's what like it this. says. If a you horrible open up a game, person. stop playing it, it will still we record. Weren't even testing it just for means that. if it does stop recording, you won't be able to see, but it's still not bad. Now, you've got a recording. Let's say you finish recording your game. You're about to finish, well, you finished that episode of the gameplay or whatever it was. Um, and now you want to finish. Don't let that down. horrible person stop, think like, discourage you. Know, it's just it. Mate, I'm not here. I'm not for that life. No. Ah! Oh! Mate, mate, that's bullying. That is. That's actually bullying. That's actually bullying. That's bullying. I just got bullied. Why is everything. Am I going mental? I'm going mental. I can't. 